Incredibly, no one was hurt on either of those buses. Kendall Green is live in Harlem where the bullets pierced those buses. And Kendall obviously could have been a lot worse. Yeah, good evening, Stephen Natasha. TWU Local 100, the union representing uh, transit workers, tells us it's a miracle no one was hurt and that it is. Let's take a look at the scene from earlier. Now, police say they're looking for at least one shooter after early this afternoon. Just before 2.40, officers responded to shots fired at 1305 Amsterdam Avenue. Now, they arrived and found two occupied MTA buses that appeared to be struck with bullets near the intersection of West Amsterdam Avenue and 125th Street. TWU Local tells us that the M101 bus was going westbound on 125th Street when gunfire erupted on the street. Now, people on the street started running as the bus that was hit had about 60 passengers sitting on, sitting and standing on it. Now, that bullet pierced the top of a window, traveled to the other side of the bus, and struck a light fixture just above the rear door. Now, the union says they were about there were about a dozen passengers on the bus and M101. Now, a bullet hit a compartment in a rear lower section of that bus. Now, there's no word on who the intended targets were for that shooting. But again, luckily, no one was hit or injured. But that doesn't lessen the frustration surrounding gun violence and safety here in the area. There was a, nothing but a bunch of police officers. And when I asked what was happening, they said that there was a shooting. And I said in the middle of the day, in broad daylight, when students are going home from school, and they were like, yes. Yeah. So it was very um, disconcerting to see that happening in our community. Now, that union president sent us a statement in part in response to that shooting, saying, uh, we're grateful that our bus operator and our passengers weren't hurt, but it's another reminder that our work can be dangerous and very stressful. People should be able to go to work and go about their lives without being menaced by gun violence. So far, there have been no arrests made in that shooting. That's the latest from Harlem tonight. Kendall Green, Fox 5 News. Steve Natasha, back yeah, to you. Yeah, definitely scary moments. Kendall, thank you.